You guys are probably wondering why I'm always dressed so formally on the desolation. Now, this is the apocalypse, yet here I am in a tuxedo. It doesn't make any sense, I know. Or does it? <laughs> What's up, guys? I am Binku49. We are back on the desolation map, and today we're working on the mall some more. I hope you guys aren't get tired, getting tired of me working on this mall. We're getting a lot of progress done, so I don't see how you could be tired of it. I mean, there's a new shop coming up every single day, from uh, cell phones to hats to spiky belts to Legos to kitchen supplies to pills <laughs> to army recruitments to watches to bold wavies. We, this mall's got everything. We got a lame stop. We got the pests turned into pets. <laughs> we got everything. Today, I want to work on a store called Suit. And I want to talk a little bit about Suits today because it seems like the topic to talk about. I know I've spelled Suit incorrectly. <laughs> that was on purpose. Okay. So I'm going to work on this a little bit. As always, Bean has no plan. <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. I don't know what I'm doing exactly. But I'm going to work on this for you. I'm going to do a little more cuts today. You know, a lot of these videos have been doing minimal cuts and showing you little progress. But today we're going to do the opposite. So uh, I have my walls here. I want to do a wall that uh, has sort of like a stripe on the top and the bottom. So that's what I'm doing here. I'll do that for you guys. Oh, wrong one. So yeah, suits. Uh, let me talk about suits a little bit. I have never in my life had a job that required me to wear a suit. <laughs> oh, that, that's not going to work like that. Let's put it there. Not, ooh, not once have I had a job that required me to wear a suit. So, as a result, I have not been jaded. I've not been beaten down. I've not had to put a suit on every day and go to some place I hate. <laughs> so I've been lucky, and that's why I kind of enjoy suits. You know, that's going to have to come out too. Yikes. I enjoy suits, guys. I would say a handful of years ago, a bunch of years ago, I went on this kick <laughs> where I was just buying suits, suit after suit after suit. It was out of control. Now, I wasn't buying like $1,000 suits or anything like that. You know, I'd spend three, dollars $400 on a suit, um, <laughs> but I was buying it like all at once, you know. I had no suits in my closet, and all of a sudden, I was buying suit after suit after suit. The guy at the store, <laughs> like, he's like, you again? <laughs> I don't know what it was. I was just, uh, I just, you know, I never had to wear the monkey suit, as I said. So, you know, I had no bad, um, no bad feelings about it. You know what I mean? If you had to wear the most comfortable clothes that you know about every day to work, and you hated to go to work, you probably wouldn't like comfortable clothes anymore. You'd be like, give me a suit. <laughs> oh man, so I'm a suit guy. I have a collection. I hardly ever wear them, <laughs> hardly ever, but when I do need to wear them, I have them. So it's better to need one and not have it than have one and not need it. Strike that, reverse it. <laughs> Maybe that's true, I don't know. <laughs> one of my favorite things uh, in Charlie and the Chocolate Factory is when Willy Wonka says, strike that, reverse it. So I say that a lot. Okay, okay, I see what I'm doing here. I'm doing the walls. <laughs> trying to cover up the outside exterior walls. I don't like seeing exterior walls in my interior, guys. That is the biggest thing in Minecraft that will um, make your buildings feel more realistic, is if you take those exterior walls and hide them when you're on the interior. So, I'm ready to start. My palette is primed. I think I'm ready here. I have no plan. <laughs> um, yeah, so let's get started, shall we? I know I want to. I know what color scheme I want to use. I want to use a lot of coal. I love the blackness, the black, the darkness. <laughs> um, so yeah, I'm gonna do racks of suits on this wall here. I think that's apropos. See a lot of suits just hanging, and you get to look at the suits, and you search for them by your size. What size am I? I have no. I forgot. <laughs> I haven't bought a suit in so long. I forgot what size I am. Oh. 30. I don't even remember, guys. That's how that's how long ago it was. But I guess I could go check, but I'm not going to do that. Okay. You know what? Let's make this even bigger. I want this to be... So this is sort of like the rack. You know what I mean? The rack where you're going to hang the suits. Hang them up. Okay. That's something. Hmm. Um... 
<laughs> Guys, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just placing blocks. You know me. This is what I do. So then we're going to have some of this. We'll have some of that. Okay. That's where the suits are hanging from. Maybe we want them hanging off the ground. Hmm. Let's see what we got here. We got dark, different types of grays and blacks. Let's see if this looks like a suit that's hanging. Sort of. Not really. Hmm. I'm going to cut it here, guys. I'm going to work on this. I'll be right back. All right, guys. I decided I had to go that way, that route. Not my favorite choice. We can't use item frames. You know that, guys. We can't use them. We are worried about lag. We're not worried about it. We are going to destroy lag, okay? Anything that can cause lag is banned on this map. So, no item frames. Of course, we'd put a, a shirt and a pant there with the item frames. So we can't do that. That's fine. That's fine. I don't care. You know, we're making do. We're making the best We making the best of this situation. I know it's not a PC. Even the PC guys deal with lag. They just don't realize it. <laughs> uh, everyone has to deal with the lag, so... I'm not even gonna, um, I'm not gonna worry about the lag so much. Alright, so, over here I wanna put, like, an area to buy shirts and stuff. Shirts and ties and things, maybe. So, I need some tables where you're gonna find shirts laid out. Um, uh, you're gonna find maybe some belts. Maybe, who knows what else you're gonna find here. But just stuff to, to go with your ensemble. Now, the reason why I kind of went on my suit kick, guys, is because I came to a realization. You're going to have to, in your life, you're going to have to go to weddings. You're going to have to go to funerals. You're going to have to dress up occasionally, you know, dinner parties, whatever. If you're going to have a girlfriend, guys, you're going to have to get dressed up. They love it. They think it's some sort of game. So you got to play their stupid little game sometimes. And, uh... <laughs> <laughs> it's not it's not fun for us. We don't like playing dress up for the most part. Men, I mean. So, you know, to appease the women, we got to do it, guys. You got to do it, I'm telling you. So, it's good to have a suit in your arsenal. And do you know why? For one simple reason. When it's time to go out and the women are getting ready, it takes them four to five hours. They got to put on their face. They got to decide what shoes to go with their purse. They got to decide what dress goes with their shoes, which goes with the belt, which goes with the purse. And then they got to pick the necklace. They're not sure which, uh, which perfume to put on because you got to test them for them. You got to make sure. Oh, my goodness. It's a whole ordeal. Four to five hours. <laughs> Girls, you know what I'm talking about. Don't deny it. Uh, <laughs> but uh, the men, us. If you have a suit, you put on that suit and all you don't have to even comb your hair. You put on that suit and you are suddenly a gentleman. You are a, a contributing member of society just by wearing that suit. Of course, you comb your hair, guys. <laughs> don't forget to comb your hair. I'm just saying you probably usually don't need to. It's like a, it's, you look like a, a, a well-dressed monkey, basically. And it shows the, the women that, yes... I will make an attempt, albeit a very minimal one. <laughs> I will make an attempt to not look like a homeless bum for you. And the women love that, and it's so easy. All you got to do is put on some pants, put on a shirt. It, I can get dressed up in my suit in under six minutes. <laughs> and you know what we do while uh, we're waiting? We play video games. Yes, you can sit in your suit and play video games. It's amazing. <laughs> um, okay, where are we here? I I'm I'm getting sidetracked. Yeah. Okay. Let's let's uh let's get back on track here. <laughs> Who doesn't want to play video games while they're forced to wait for somebody? Is great. It really is. So you know, do it do it for the video games, guys. If <laughs> I know a lot of you are young, but you're not ready to buy suits yet. But think about it. Don't um be don't be totally against the idea because it has its benefits. Yes, it has benefits, that's for sure. Okay. So-so. Mm, I don't know. Um, hey, Bat, get out of here. This is a formal place. I don't know. This is very rough. This is all very rough, guys. Uh, what I want to put here, maybe a different color, is where they tailor the suits. Yes, you stand here. Well, we need a mirror, though. Hmm, you're going to need a wall with a mirror. Yowzer, what have I done? Okay, let's take out this. 
take it all out. This is going to be the tailoring section. You can't go buy a suit and not get it tailored. That's half the fun, guys. Half the fun is getting a suit that fits your body perfectly like a glove. Um, <laughs> it doesn't take much either to get a suit fitted for you. They take a few measurements. And yeah, basically you tell them how you want it. There's so many different styles. You can get, uh, you can get the, the, the cuff, put a different length. You can get all sorts of things. There's British versions of suits, American versions. Styles are constantly changing. So, you know, it's, it's very, um, you can't keep up with it all. Who can? I can't keep up with it all. But, you know, once or twice, three times a lady buying a suit. It's a pretty fun experience. I liked it. I don't think I'm going to buy any more suits. I don't plan on ever having a job that requires me to wear a suit. And if I do, <laughs> it'll probably be in my casket. <laughs> yeah, so that'll be the next time I'm forced to wear a suit is the casket. <laughs> That's my mirror there. Here we go. It's not that I don't like wearing suits. It's just that... That's not me. Basically, it's me trying to fool people into thinking that I'm an adult. <laughs> Basically, is all it is. So this is where you stand and the tailor starts grabbing you and feeling you up and all sorts of things. And you stand and stare at the mirror. Pretty simple. Okay. Um, <laughs> what else do we need? We need racks of ties. Okay. Maybe more suits. This is not a lot of suits. So maybe that's the, the high-end suits. We can have a rack of suits. Where would those go? Maybe we could put like that. Three deep. Yes, yes. Let's go higher. There we go. So this can be like a rack of suits just in the middle of the store. Not all suits are super expensive. You can buy a decent suit for a hundred bucks. Well, I wouldn't call it decent, but... Uh, you know, you can spill beer on it and not care. <laughs> yeah, I spilled beans. I, I didn't spill beans, but beans, uh, what are they called? Frijoles? No, refried beans. Got the, someone put refried beans on my suit at a wedding once. I don't know what happened. You know, there's a lot of alcohol involved. I'm not sure, really. Um, but that's just, it's terrible. This, the problem with suits is you got to get them dry cleaned, and that's a whole ordeal. Ugh. It's better not to deal with it. Thank goodness. Guys, we don't have to wear suits in our daily lives. Yeah, this is a bit weird. Just a bit weird, isn't it? Mm, not a big fan of this. Ah, I wish I could use item frames. I really do. Oh, well. What can you do? Um, I really enjoy suits with uh, vests. You know the vest, the three-piece? Those are cool. All right, that's a suit. There's some more suits. And it's a zoot suit ride in here. Let's do a tie rack. This I'm not sure how to do. How are we going to do a tie rack? All right. You guys are about to see some spontaneous creativity just popping out here. I don't know what I'm going to do, but I'm going to be confident that it's going to come out okay. Guys, trust me on this. Just trust. Oh, of course. I wouldn't expect anything less. These suits are getting ruined. <laughs> They're getting ruined in the rain. Oh, no. Who's going to pay for all of this? Okay, so we need some ties. I don't know how to do a tie. Ties are going to be a little blocky. They're not necessarily ties, guys, but you get the idea. So let's go. You're going to get the ideas. That's a tie. That's a tie. <laughs> not quite a tie, but there are racks of colorful things. And I think that's all that matters, guys. As long as it's understood that this is a suit store, and there's stuff to loot in there. What are you going to loot in the suit store? I don't know. Um, that's a good question. What are you, are you, oh, this is in the way. Let's move that. I have yet to do the counter. So the counters in these places where you pay are very minimalistic because, I mean, what are they? They're little tables where you scan your credit card. They don't need to put stuff in bags. Uh, okay, so let's get a little table. Maybe some... Let's do uh, one of these. One of these deals. Get a little table going. Right. Actually, before we do the table, let's do the display. I was going to put a display and I forgot all about it. Okay. Hold on. Okay, we got black wool. Here are the, here are the, the suits. Okay. One. Two. Oh, this isn't going to work. This isn't going to work at all. I was going to do a little mannequin guy with the little head, Steve head on top. Huh. 
Maybe if we change this to glass, that's a start. Change this to nothing. Let's see what we got here. Oh, guys, you're getting a glimpse. Okay, I'm going to cut it here. I'll be back, guys. This is going on too long. <laughs> okay, guys. I have a display. You want to go see the display? Here we go. That's the display. That's three guys wearing suits. <laughs> That's the best I got. I'm sorry. If you guys have any suggestions for this store, I'm all ears. Why is it still raining? Oh. But uh, <laughs> I'm all ears. I'm working in the rain for no particular reason. I don't know why. Uh, we don't have any chests in here, which is an issue. We need to have some chests, so I'll, I'll think about putting these somewhere. Maybe like this. You guys didn't see this, okay? For those of you who watch my channel and play The Desolation, this is for you. There's little secrets that only you guys are going to know about. And I'm cool with that. <laughs> because thank you for watching, basically. Thank you guys for supporting me, for watching this channel, for sharing everything. It's been tremendous. I'm having a lot of fun making these videos. I hope you guys are having a lot of fun watching these videos. And uh, I'm going to keep making them if you guys keep enjoying them. Because you guys have shown so much love. I really appreciated it. Yes. So thank you. So this is for you. I'm going to show you the secrets. <laughs> Some of the secrets. So you're going to have to break a carpet and investigate those chests if you're going to want to find stuff in this store. I don't know what you're going to find, but it should be something. Clothing. Maybe a lot of clothing in here. Clothing, which translates roughly in Desolation's talk to uh, leather... Uh, armor. <laughs> That's what clothing is. For the most part, the, some of the tougher clothing will be, um, what's it called? Iron, <laughs> chain mail, you know, that sort of thing. Here's where the counter, where are you going to pay? Okay. Usually don't take cash at these places. <laughs> For obvious reasons. I mean, they do take cash, of course. Everyone takes cash. But who has a thousand dollars in cash? Just in their wallets, you know what I mean? So, let's put a little thing here. I like this to symbolize sort of where you put your stuff, your credit card maybe. Over here, we're going to have to color this. I love to color my tables. No ta I don't like my tables being the same. Look at this. There we go. More better. Thank you. Over here, we can definitely put a chest with more stuff. I don't know what's going to go on here. What is this? Maybe um, maybe some slabs to simulate shirts, stacked shirts. Okay, those are some shirts. The more little details like this, the better. We can come out like that, maybe. Put a shirt on there. There we go. Yeah, this is looking, got a little bit of color. Um, those are ties, I guess. I could do, be I could do better than that. That's right, guys. Do not accept... Do not accept stuff like that. Okay, I can do better than that. You guys know I can. I know I can. Let's see what we can do here. Oh, this is probably going to be the last thing. I don't know how long this video has gone on for, but it's it's been a while, I'm sure. So let's uh, make this the last thing, and then we'll call this a suit store. <laughs> there we go. This is a little bit more like a tie rack. And then we can maintain the iron bar theme. That's no problem. I'm down with that. It's a little better. Guys, I don't know. If you have suggestions for how to do a tie rack, I'm all ears because that's ugly. <laughs> that doesn't mean anything. I don't know what that is. So, I'm running out of time here. I'm going to put a roof on this place. I'm sorry I couldn't get it all done. You know what? I'm going to cut it here and show you the final roof. Okay? Let's do the roof quick. I'll be back. All right, guys. That's my ceiling. Still raining. 4J. Come on now. This is a... Uh... Thank you. <laughs> See, if you complain about something enough, you'll get your way. Uh, so that's the ceiling. Nothing too fancy. Nothing outlandish. I just started making a pattern, and that's what came out. Got some lights on the ceiling to make it look like there was light in here at one point. We're going to put lights on the floors so that it is bright in here when you flip the switch. I'm also going to put more detail work. I need a better tie rack. You guys know. We'll work on that. But for the most part, this is the first draft of the suit. The Zoot Suit Riot. So... I want to thank you guys for coming on this suit adventure with me and listening to me rant about suits. Buy a suit if you don't have one already. You just need one. Just one in your arsenal. That's all it takes. The ladies love it. You know, you'll need it at some point, so might as well have it. 
And uh, it can be a fun experience buying a suit. Who knows? Anyway, thank you guys for watching as always. Please like if you enjoyed this or if you got something out of it. Share with your friends, all that good stuff. Happy Minecrafting. Peace.